gremlin. This is Eminem's car. They don't know. But if they did, I don't think they'd care. You're driving a minivan, I'm driving a gremlin. I know you're gonna dig this. Get, get, get funky with me. What's going on everybody? How you doing today? So here I am in Branson, Missouri. This is a place I've been to twice now. I did a huge video last year. Never put it up because I was on the phone with the owner of the museum the night after I filmed and we were talking about the museum and while we were doing the tour I had asked him if he had any cars belonging to Eminem or anything to do with Eminem. He said no. Do you think I should uh you think I, would, would that be a draw? I think I should get one. I was like it'd be a draw for me. I don't know about anybody else. But I would definitely love to see that. Literally an hour later, he texts me a picture of her car. He says, you recognize this car? And I said, that's the car from the D12 video, Purple Pills. Purple Hills, Purple Pills, same song, different lyrics. They had to change it because Purple Pills, a little, little suggestive and uh, drug and sex. It's Eminem and D12. What do you think it's going to be? It is blue and yellow, purple so I said, that's it. I said, oh my God, that's a D12 car. That's so cool. Then an hour later, he texts me back. He says, well, I bought it for the museum. I was blown away, and I said, well, I'm gonna wait then till I can get back out to Branson and do all new videos, but I'm gonna do one just about the M&M car. And here with me is my good buddy, Andy. Hello. This is Andy, you work at the museum. I do, what's I your, do all What's your official title? I do all the social media and the research and the verification on the cars. Right, you reached out to me about a year ago and I came out here, we had like three days together, all of us hanging yeah, out. Yeah, you were here for a long time. We filmed a bunch of videos. <laughs> and I never put any of them up because of the M&M car. Well, you put one of them up. I, oh, I put the Jeepers yeah, Creepers one up. Yeah, 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 yeah. I put the Jeepers Creepers one up. And then when I, when Scott, the owner, told me about the M&M car, I was like, I got to redo everything. I got to I got to rethink everything because it's M&M. He's very excited. I'm very excited. I got the M&M jacket, M&M shirt, M&M tattoo, M&M watch. Yes, I'm a freak. Right inside here is the car used. M&M sat in this car. I'm I'm about to just. Psh, I've already seen it, so I, I just. Uh, just full disclosure, <laughs> but I'm still very excited. And it runs, and we're gonna drive it, and we're gonna knock on the door. Sorry, say that again. I love how excited <laughs> you are. That's true. As soon as I, I we, you know, we've just been chill talking, but as soon as I start thinking about, I'm actually gonna sit in the car and drive it. Watch this. Watch this. Now we're just. We're, this is. I should say we're we're gonna. There's gonna be a video coming up on my channel about the Celebrity Car Museum, right? Yes. And this is the storage area. Yeah, this is our offsite storage facility where cars come first to get worked on and verified and ready to be in the museum right so secret facility secret facility and my good buddy Adam's been out here yeah we came Adam came here and we looked at the Tommy boy car right but we're here today right now for Eminem let's knock on the door oh Clem oh Clem there we go you have one job Clem there it is. Oh, hey, look. And there's Scott, too. Very exciting. So, who, uh, now, well, I got to introduce Clem first because I, I was already talking about it. This is Clem, the general manager Hello. of the Celebrity Car Museum. You're also one of the mechanics. You worked on this car, right? You were showing me videos. Yeah. And you, you were working on it. You were doing yeah. something. Yeah. And Scott, you have something small to do with the museum, right? There's no, something. What, really. what do you do? I heard that Clean up afterwards? I do. I, I'm part of the maintenance crew. Yeah. I come in afterwards and... Just complain about what everybody did the wrong way. <laughs> Absolutely. This, this is look at this. This is Scott Velvet, the owner of the Celebrity Car Museum. Tell me a little bit about yourself, Scott. Well, actually, you know what? We're gonna save that for the next video. Sounds good. I don't. Want, I don't care. We're, you're gonna tell me on the next video okay. because I just told a story about how you were texting me the night you bought this, and you're like. Yeah, this car oh, yeah. is oh, yeah. so casual, <laughs> and I was like, "Did you buy it for me? No, bought it for the museum." But still, this is it. This is it. 
So yes, thank you, Andy, for mentioning that. You you left it. Yeah, we left it here in the secret facility in storage, waiting for you to come here and see it first. Right. You you did say that to me. You said, you said I will wait for you, but not that long because you want to put it on display. Right. But yeah. it's been almost a year, so thank you. It's been a while. Yeah. Yeah. It's yeah. been it's been it was November of 2021. I was yeah, here. Like that. Feels like yesterday. Yeah. But this is it. This is the car that's in Purple Pills. Now, I can refer to the video as Purple Hills or Purple Pills. If you search for the video on YouTube, it's good. Purple Hills is going to come up. And like I said, they had to change the lyrics um, and the title. So there's two versions of the song, two versions of the video as well. And the Purple Pills video is very poor quality because it was never really released properly. But Purple Hills, probably about 100 million views, 50 million views, one of D12's biggest songs. And if you don't know D12, D12 is a collective, uh, hip hop collective from Detroit that Eminem was a part of. There's eight members originally, then it went down to six. And Eminem, in the video, sat right here. So Clem, there's something very awesome as well about this car. I'm gonna stand over here, here, and you're gonna show me, right? Yes. Here we go. You were working on this yesterday. Bounce, bounce. <laughs> That's all I got. <laughs> That's pretty good, though. So Scott, we were just talking, the like, Gremlins don't usually have hydraulics. I've driven the, uh, not driven, I was in the Tupac Lowrider, yeah. and Nipsey Hussle's Lowrider. Those are ones you see with hydraulics. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Oh, yeah. This one, uh, I don't know why they picked it. I guess it's because it's so weird and orange and just, yeah. just kind of a uh, crazy car. But uh, it's the only one I've ever seen with hydraulics. And uh, it was actually in a rental fleet out in California. When they picked it for the video, they rented it and then probably added the hydraulics and stuff to, to suit. And then, you know, it sat there for a long time, just kind of like, you know, in the same state. Right. And then a gentleman bought it and he kind of did a mechanical restoration on it. And, uh, you know, he left all of the, the marks and stuff that you would see in the video, but uh, he did a mechanical restoration, but there's no telling how many movies and television shows and music videos that this car was actually in. Right, so it gets rented out, it got rented out for so many oh, other yeah. productions. Absolutely. But it still has, really cool, on the back, the Beastie Boys sticker. Eminem, huge fan of the Beastie Boys, huge influence on them. And those are the batteries in the back for the hydraulics, correct? That is correct. That's so cool. Still got the tag, the original California tags on it. I'm not sure if those tags were left on in the video or not. Uh, I can't tell. I, I was zooming in this morning trying to see if it said Michigan or right. California, but it's but hard. they may have just taken the tags off. Yeah, those were the tags that went with it when it was in the rental fleet. Right. So what year is this car? Do we know? I think it's a '73. '73. I'd have to look on the title, but it looks like a '73, '74. I'm not a gremlin expert. <laughs> you know. And in the video, Eminem's always the one driving. And in the first part, I believe he's sitting with uh, Kniva and con artist, Mr. Porter, just the three of them in the front. But then they get all six of them in the car, right. which it's a tiny car and there's no middle seat, uh, which is crazy. There's no wonder that the seats are all torn up. <laughs> yeah, that makes sense because they had Eminem here, bizarre, and the late great proof but bizarre is a big boy right yeah and he's 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 sitting in the middle oh, no. that had to be cramped look at that it looks almost like a, a a seat heater that's in there wonder why i don't know a seat heater in a gremlin in yeah the i mean it just doesn't make any sense look at that look at the furry <laughs> look what is that? Yeah, like like the oh. little shoulder pad yeah 
but it's burned up from the sun out there in California. Sitting oh, is that there. why it's like that? Yeah, it's like sitting out in storage. It's almost like a, a lot of times the cars look like they've been in a flash fire. Wow. But yeah, that was where Proof is sitting, and Proof actually has my favorite verse on the song. It's a great part of the song when Proof comes on. But yeah, there's, there's six grown men in this tiny thing. That's wild. That was probably part of the gimmick. They're like, hey, let's do this yeah, like, clown car. Yeah. Let's call a pile in there. That's very true, yeah. silly, you know? Gotta slam it again. What? Gotta slam it again. Slam it's it like again. It's like halfway. Oh, it's like I think the, I think the door handle is popped. right back here we go you should never film while you're driving that's why I have one of the things stuck to the thing in my car but we're just going around it right into here yes this is wild holy jeez all right let's go right back this is actually really easy to drive after driving your Jeepers Creepers truck. Oh, last that year, thing's a death that, trap. That, that, that's horrible to drive. This is fun. I like this. We're gonna take it on the open road. Wow. This is crazy. So it's actually Back full on gas. Yeah. But it needs a little bit of, it says it needs a little bit of gas, but it's broken. What? Oh my god. Okay, now we yes. This is Eminem's car. Well what not not technically his car, but he sat here in a video. I'm gonna say it's his favorite. I think it's his favorite car. I feel the need. The need for weed. If you're around that time of Eminem's career, <laughs> definitely. Oh, we got gas here last time. I remember this gas station. This is wild. What? I, ooh, let's see if I can beat this car. All of a sudden starts going fast and then says, no, I can't do it. Then goes fast again, then it's like, no, I really don't want to do this. This is a 50-year-old car almost. Gremlin. This is Eminem's car. They don't know. But if they did, I don't think they'd care. You're driving a minivan, I'm driving a Gremlin. Fuck you. Put it in reverse. Did some of the earliest cars not have reverse? No, I think they all had reverse, but uh, it was kind of fly by the seat of your pants. Yeah. Here we 
go. All right. So should I put? It, you're gonna put it in park for the hydraulics? Mm, I don't know. Try Where it. are they? Right here. All right. What do I do? Click it back towards you. Oh, I see. <laughs> Shit. Head that down. <laughs> That's, what? That's crazy. <laughs> it's, oh my god. How is this comfortable? It's not. <laughs> it's not really. <laughs> That's wild. <laughs> Proof set right here. Proof set right here. Bizarre. Eminem. There it is. This is a car from Purple Pills. Wow. Thinking about what kind, you probably already watched the video if you've stuck around this long, hopefully you have. I, what music I put over it, because I really want to put it over that beat and uh, and also the harmonica solo at the end of the song. What rap song has a harmonica solo? Come on. But copyright issues, just can't do it. Just can't do it. So maybe I've stuck in a little bit. But that's it. That's the car. That's it. Right there. Eminem sat. All Shit. right, Andy, Clem, thank you. I'm a grown man obsessed with Eminem. I appreciate it. <laughs> I appreciate it so much. That's wild. We just sat in Eminem's video car, drove it around. I gave the finger. It's what we do best. Oh, man. Uh, subscribe if you like cars because I got, I, got, I got more videos coming from this place. And I've got something else about having to do with cars. I know nothing about cars. I know I, I, if somebody were to sell me a car, my first question is, how many cup holders? Second question is, what's the stereo like? Third question, I don't have a third question. I just want cup holders and a good stereo. And good rims. <laughs> good rims? You gotta, have the, you, gotta, you gotta have the rims. I was actually thought about that once. I was like, gonna change the rims on my car. And I was like, well, I don't see them. Yeah. <laughs> what, what do I care? <laughs> I was, There's logic I'm in that. I'm inside the car. Like, really, I was like, I don't see them. I don't, like, I was looking at rims, and, I, and somebody's telling me, oh, you could put these rims on your car. I was like, yeah, I could, but... I don't see them. I don't care what anybody else sees. <laughs> it's a, my car. But thank you. And Scott, thank you. You're going to be in my next video. And Andy, you were telling me that one of the videos I filmed that I haven't put up yet from California was going to be... Uh, it's, a, it's, a, it's a good one, yeah. i got to put but it up. Not, not a lot of people get to film there, I promise. Okay, I'm going to put it up. Exclusive. It's going to be exclusive on my channel. I can't wait to see it. Yeah. I, I, I don't think I really... I'm, not, I'm so... Uh, like I love cars, I love looking at them, but I don't know anything about them. So I, when I filmed at this other place that's coming up on my channel, I had no idea that it was such a cool place to be. I've never heard of anyone else filming a YouTube video there. Boom, done. Put it up soon. All right, thanks everybody. Clem, you the man. Peace. Out. For Eminem. Stop story and make everybody get forgiven. Yeah.